can you feed honey? If so, what nutrients does it provide to our horses? Thank you very much. I love your videos. <laughs> All right. Um, so I think honey has had a, a recent surge in popularity. I mean, would you agree with that? Like it just seems to be everywhere used for everything right now. It's very popular. One of the hot Trending. topics right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trending. Hashtag, <laughs> hashtag honey, whatever. <laughs> um, but the one of the things that I see it used for a lot and it's actually in the scientific literature is on wounds. Oh. Now, she didn't ask that. that that's no. a different that's a different ask to that. And maybe somebody will ask that and we'll talk about that then. But today we're talking about hint, hint to all honey. you people out there trying to submit questions. <laughs> I know. Wink wink. Um, so anyway, this 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 today is just is is feeding honey. And mm -hmm. the short story is honey doesn't provide much in the way of nutrition. So mm -hmm. it's it's got negligible levels of of protein and fat and fiber and, and like trace levels of vitamins and minerals. But it does have a pretty high levels of um, plant compounds or of uh, bioflavonoids that serve as antioxidants. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, and, right. And so uh, there was actually a study on uh, buckwheat honey in particular that said it can, it can increase the levels of antioxidants in your blood. Wow. So, yeah. And so, that's buckwheat um, honey specifically, okay. Right, right. And so there's that component. The other is a tablespoon of honey is about um, 21 grams. And there's 17 grams of sugar in that okay. one tablespoon. So it is mostly okay. sugar. Um, and so it's, it's, a, it's tasty and yep. it's a, a readily available source of, of energy. So I, I think I read that um, a lot of endurance horses, people are giving it to their endurance horses in, when they're racing to sort of as a pick-me-up as a quick burst of energy and speed. Get a little sugar boost before going, yeah. A little sugar boost, yeah. The nice thing, that, or the neat thing about honey is that it's not just uh, like table sugar, refined, you know, overly processed uh, 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 glucose. It's, it's made up of a couple. So there's glucose, there's sucrose, there's maltose, and fructose. Um, there's no, there's no, it's not high fructose corn syrup, that really overprocessed stuff you find in, you know, cereals and, and ketchup and things. And so yeah. kind of the bottom line is it's, um, it's a less bad sweetener. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best of the bad options. <laughs> there you go. So um, you use it in very small amounts and you can use it to, uh, if you have a picky eater, you know, you throw it in, you can use like molasses. Mm -hmm. If you um, trying to ha hide or mask medication, it can be handy. I've used it for um, teaching a young, maybe three-year-old horse to accept a bit. He's I like, which horse that could be? <laughs> I have no idea. This is fabulous. You can put it on your deworming syringe, and and they can be like, well, at first it tasted good, and then it got a little bitter. Um, so that the, the one thing I want to point out though is that you don't want to use the the off the shelf grocery store um, honey. Don't get the idea that that is what goes in a wound. So if if until we do our video on on that. Um, talk to your vet and use the medical grade honey. So that's a separate issue. You also don't want to give honey to a foal. Mm. And it's the same reason that human doctors advise not giving human infants honey because it, it could contain botulism spores okay. and the, the immature gut is not capable of protecting itself against that. And there are, there are cases in the literature of uh, horse babies and human babies getting botulism from honey. So it's, oh, it's wow. only for adult horses and it's only in small amounts for those specific uses. That's all. okay. So it sounds like honey can potentially help with some antioxidant support. Yeah. Little, little boost of energy if needed and yeah. also can be kind of helpful for in training or if you need your horse to mask something that your horse yeah. is yeah. trying to feed your horse. Yeah. But other than that, as far as like nutritionally, there's not much benefit. No. It's, it's just, natural sugar 